Welcome to this course on iMachine. iMachine is a really cool sampling groove box for iOS. It runs on iPad, iPhone, and more recent iPod Touch models. It's also got some interesting 3D touch features if you happen to have a newer device which supports Apple's 3D touch technology. It looks a little bit like the desktop version of Machine, but not a lot. It's its own application completely built from scratch. Let's take a quick tour of the interface. Up at the top here you have your main toolbar with play and record buttons, a tempo select section, you can set your tempo manually by swiping here, you can tap a tempo, you can add swing to your pattern, you can have quantize switched on or off, you'll almost certainly want to leave that switched on, you can switch your metronome on, and you can choose to auto enable the metronome whenever you record. There's a manual metronome button here next to the tempo readout. In the name field, we can see the name of my current preset, which I can rename if I like. Along the left hand edge are the main navigational tools for the app. Up at the very top, you can access the system menu. You can see that here, you're able to start a new project, open an existing project, and on the right are the projects which are already stored on my iPad. You can also switch between NI's own presets and user presets using these buttons here. You can save any preset just like I did a minute ago. And you have export controls here, which we'll look at a little bit later. And there's a help section as well. So you can see if I tap here, these are the new features in the latest version of the software. And of course this gets updated as the software gets updated. And there's a help section here if you're ever unclear about how something works.